You guys, okay, I'm back on again real quick. I want to again speak on Revelation chapter 2 and verse 11. I want to reiterate that again to you. Again, it says, He who has an ear, let him hear what the Spirit says to the church. He who overcomes shall not be hurt by those by the second death. So that second death, second death again, you guys. We're talking about judgment, the judgment seat that you know we all will bow our knee before Christ, before the Mashiach, the King of Kings and Lord of Lords. But also that second death of the fiery flame, where we're not talking about the good fiery flame and burning. We're talking about burning the hearts out because the garments are scarred and, and not cleansed so burning out the flesh leaving scar tissue leaving um disorder deception uh chaos and then um it not being washed clean so you're going into the second judgment before the most high but also second judgment of what is happening in the last days very keen to understand that Again, I will be talking about celebrity vid video with Beyonce and then sexual agenda. And this this will be probably closer to one of my last videos. Um, I truly want to say something real quick before I briefly speak on uh, more than I needed to say on the video. I have three videos that need to be uploaded fully. One is right now. One is from before. And then one is this next one I'm speaking of. I will then only be on YouTube um, giving prophetic calls from the Most High, exactly what he wants me to say. I'll be talking about somewhat um, children and then heavenly word and heavenly tongue. So I want to say this. Uh, I will also be getting into relationships, uh, single parenting, um, just relationships, things like that, marriage, things like that, and then also topics, um, timely topics as well. I'm sorry, I have an incoming call as well, and I'm not able to reach reach it right now. Um, I've been on this YouTube for quite a while and never really ask too much in the ministry for finances. So I do projects, I've worked jobs, I've, I've done a lot, and the Most High needs me to finish these books. There is some of this ministry that I'm going to be broadening out. I am going to live the dreams the Most High has given me, live the calling, live what I have to. Part of this is YouTube, but part of it also is that in ministry, there's no tithing for me right now. I don't, the tithing. So I sacrifice in my fasting. I fa sacrifice in my tithing of what I get. And there have been brethren. There's a brother that has helped twice, uh, two and three times to help. They've been helpful to me and my family. Um, but, you know, brethren don't really donate here. And I'm saying this because there are a lot more subscribers and I'm saying this because this work never stops. You do this work regardless. This work is your work that's called in your life, the purpose, it's a testimony, it's truth. It's the wisdom the Most High puts in us, the understanding, right? So I've been on YouTube over five years. Now there was a time period I wasn't for that two years, but I, I've been doing this like for seven years. So in the ministry fully. So I wanna say that where I'm at right now and where things are at, there are some things in my personal life that I can attest to that I, I will be giving testimonies and things, but these are also going to be in books. I'm also going to be writing. I'm going to be doing poetry. I'm going to be getting into other businesses, things of that sort uh, for income. And it's all ministry because it's all based on the most high wanting me to give a personal gift. It's a gift. It's a treasured gift that the most high has put in us right through him. So just letting you know, when I do put PayPal on there, it's because I don't ever ask um, for specifics. There are a lot of brethren that ask to be a member and they, you know, they charge $2 for you to get a newsletter. I have a hard time giving it out free because no one is emailing me and, and wanting it. It's amazing to me. There's so much understanding. And so now I have to, I definitely have, you know, I have bills to pay. I have a life to live. And yes, I, I have rent and all these things that have to be taken care of as well. So I'm saying this because 
it's important to understand this this is we take this time and I do this during work I do this um, when the most high calls me when I'm in the middle of sleeping whatever it is so just know that this is heartfelt this is from the heart this is why I'm so serious about the work I'm so serious about things but I'm also being um, the enemy because of what the call is now in my life, the most the most highs let me know the enemy is really after me. He's breaking up friendships with me. He's break trying to break relationships, all kinds of things. But the most high is sending divine replacements, divine understanding, divine ones to love and show love to me. And that's a beautiful thing because love is so hard to find in this world. Many think that they uh, are giving you love and they're not showing you love. And the reason why I say that, they can give a kind word or something, but they want to take, take, take. We also, as prophets, need to receive. I also need to receive love in my life. I need to receive. Yes. So your children give love. Friends give love. Brethren give love. The 12 tribes of Israel grafted in. Brethren, bride of Christ give love. Those that visit you on YouTube and your, and your platform and your walk. We also need personal love. And I understand where I'm at with things my age I understand the lifestyle the living that I that I want the living water that the peace of mind the not chaos I want I, I understand the love so I give it to you I also like to receive it just remember it is a receiving thing always try to leave a comment I don't get the comments comments are usually from videos way back so I understand some are catching up so let's get into this thank you so much to new subscribers and thank you for visiting right now okay hallelujah real quickly here because I say quickly because I really do have to um, get somewhere real quick and take care of some other things so powers that be the new age agenda okay it's the area of commerce now warning I looked up revelation again okay so we're gonna go through revelation 2 7 through 17 in the next video and I will be looking up again at work I'll be looking this up it's called declaration of self-sufficiency USC is irs.gov the most high let me know that the evil powers that be are are starting have started an agenda obviously with snap uh, food stamps uh, uh tanf um self-sufficiency renters uh things that have to do with renters insurance renters um protection during this time of COVID, all these things that have happened all these lies deception fear in the world everything that's going on I mean, we come on the most the most now the most highs let me know and sisters have said this on their channels and i'm going to reiterate this again and back them up death is the final death if you're sinning if if, if you don't if you do not know yahusha if you don't if you don't take him into your heart again you are what okay we come to the most highs children right to get into the kingdom we come as children go from baby milk to salt food but this is the thing death is the final death so if forget COVID, forget the fears forget bombs forget earthquakes forget natural disasters if you if you don't know yahusha if you don't try to know him if you don't believe in him that he died for you if you don't believe that that blood is that sacrifice that he gave and that blood is the cleansing and his living water is the cleansing the new garment then no oil or anything if you don't believe in that receiving that oil then you're going to go for the agenda. You're going to go for the powers of be. You're going to go for that lie. And with that being said, going with that lie, you're obviously at that point, a person is not going to choose life. They choose death. So it doesn't matter what COVID you get. It doesn't matter coronavirus, virus, crickets. I mean, whatever it is that we have, we're dealing with here, whatever it is, food shortages, ultimate is death that's the ultimate so we have to remember that so i will be looking this up i need to talk more about it but it was called 344 and 144 so those are two different sections that i had seen one for uh, immigration laws and one for self-sufficiency so be very careful if you're on a 501c3 be careful if you're on make sure you're updating and finding out about the tax cuts some things won't be tax cuts tax cuts so in my business um, that i've started in, in these new businesses there's a lot of write-offs but there's a lot of changes with w4 especially when you start a new position you no longer can claim nine you no longer can just claim your children if they're 17 and older a lot of weird things that you can only do during the actual tax time that you talk to your accountant or you talk to a tax preparer so just check that out because it is also a work of the enemy trump was an entrepreneur but it's a work of the enemy to have this agenda we didn't get a second stimulus right but it's a work of the uh 
It's the work of the enemy, and it's through IRS.gov. So understand, be wise as serpent, gentle, gentle as doves. Give your father Abba glory and glorify his name. You are the light of this wicked world, he says. This is what he said today. He told me prophetically, understand the self-sufficiency, one of the agendas is uh, the 344. Four. And that's why I was going into love you because it's a false love, a false deception, a false sense of security. So be very careful and wise um, wise about what you do with your licenses, what you do. And that's even for me. Hallelujah, Father. Praise Abba. And that is a, also a testimony there and a second witness to that. So be very careful um, what you allow them to give you free. So just be careful of that because that's what I'm understanding. Okay. Next. This is what the Most High says. His prophetic word to me. Today, dated today. Uh, the 20th of October. Judge he not, judgment is mine, saith the Lord. My son will rejoice as the righteous bloodshed for his kingship. Is crowned not the wicked? Powers that be, my beloved, brick, warriors of Christ. Excuse me, let me repeat that. I had that incorrect because of my letter here. My beloved, powers Okay, so we're going to start over. Let me start over. I do apologize. I have started. It has to be verbatim for the Most High. Judge he not. Judgment is mine, saith the Lord. My son will rejoice as the righteous bloodshed for his kingship is crowned, and not the wicked powers that be. My beloved bride, warriors of Christ, prophecy, be diligent. Conquer the evil with my will on your life. They will not prevail. Forward and honor my throne. Honor my throne. My son's throne, crown of, crown of life, tree of goodness, eternal flame, fire, burning oil of lamp. Pay attention. Read to see their evil. It was dated today, October 20th. Okay, so I will put that there. Thank you so much for joining me. I have another channel I have to get on and do that um, a little later so again remember correct prophecy and prophetic word from the most high versus false and fake and understand that many that are saying oh no there's no new mysteries there's no scrolls open there's nothing being said that's not true there is much being said now most high is sending his prophets out because there's he, he's re he's revealed the veil has torn he's Yahusha's just open it wide open our eyes are open 2020 perfect vision whether we have a leap year whether they've changed the times fall back spring ahead it's still the time the most high comes into the time regardless he comes into it so burning flames so understand judgment redemption and for some of us who our dreams are going to be fulfilled as he has given us based on our obedience based on him telling us so what he has given us he has given us and the time is now, the time is being fulfilled. The time has been turned back into giving us the callings and, and receiving. Even this position I'm at, I applied three times. This was something for the most high that I needed to do right now. Going, excuse me, from my allergies, from fall into winter. Also, I want to let you know ashwagandha, lime and lemon juice and alkaline water. Please make sure you get that salt water to cleanse your body from toxins because the enemy does not want you to at all receive anything from the Most High. I love you so much with the love of Christ and until next time, Shalom.